First John, five. Verse six. This is He that came by water and blood, even Jesus Christ. Not by water only, but by water and blood. And it is the Spirit that beareth witness, because the Spirit is truth. For there are three that bear record in heaven: the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. And these three are one. And there are three that bear witness in earth: the Spirit and the water and the blood. And these three agree in one. The scripture I want to emphasize is verse seven: for there are three that bear record in heaven: the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. And these three are one. The word "record" bear record in heaven: God the Father, the Word of God, and the Holy Spirit. Emphasis on the Word of God. The word of God bears record in heaven. Romans two, verse twelve. For as many as have sinned without the law shall also perish without the law, and as many as have sinned in the law shall be judged by the law. For not the hearers of the law are just before God. But the doers of the law shall be justified. Emphasis on verse twelve: For as many as have have sinned without the law shall perish without the law, and as many as have sinned in the law shall be judged by the law. Those that do not even know God, those that are not born again. They don't have the law of God. They don't have the word of God. Yet still, they will perish without it. They will still perish without the law. But those who do know God, those who profess to be Christians, those who do read the word of God and believe in the word of God. Will be judged by it. Will be judged by the words in this book, in the Bible. Going back to First John chapter five, verse seven. For there are three that bear record in heaven, and one of those that bear record in heaven is the Word of God. So, it's the Word of God. That will judge us in the day of judgment. Meaning, did we obey it? Did we obey the word of God? And whatever we have not obeyed, that word will judge us in the day of judgment. Revelation two sixteen. Repent, or else I will come unto thee quickly, and will fight against them with the sword of my mouth. Jesus Christ is the Word of God, become flesh. The sword in His mouth is the word that pierces. It's the word that bears record, and it's the word that will judge us. It's the word that bears record. Did we obey the word, or did we dismiss it and made light of it?